Get the upper hand on your competition with scuff controllers. Use code OGXRACE to get 5% off your entire order. Yo guys, what's up? It's x -Rays. Welcome back to another Fortnite video. Now, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to complete all of the Week 5 challenges easily or the fastest way to possibly do them. Some of these will be in separate videos. The ones that will be in separate videos are going to be the Follow the Trap from Anarchy. That's going to be its own video, along with a video on where all the gas stations are. So if you want to see those, I'm going to have them in a separate video. In this one, we're going to go over the rest of these challenges. Now, we did accidentally get these because of a leak on a Fortnite tracker. So I'm going to go ahead and go through these. Some of these are subject to change. Remember, some of these, like the gas station ones, for instance, is probably going to be five locations as opposed to one that it has on the image but we're gonna go through all of them starting off with use the bush now this one I couldn't get any footage of it uh, it like I just had terrible luck and I couldn't find any so we're gonna start with that one and we'll just pretend like I have footage literally all you have to do find the bush put it on boom that's it that challenge is complete so really no tips or anything that'll make it go faster if you find them you find them if you're not then this could take a while but as soon as you find one make sure you take it and you use it so you can complete that one the next one is going to be deal damage with a pickaxe now this one is uh, one that you can go about it two ways the first one you can just go into solo and go into an area that's going to be heavily populated when you shoot down and you parachute down, make sure you land with someone as they're, you know, pickaxing their way through a roof or something. And literally, you just pickaxe them and try to kill them or get as much damage as you can. The good thing is you don't need to get a kill. You just need to get damage, which is basically in a 200. It could be more depending. Again, this is like an early leak and I'm getting this video to you guys early. So it could be more damage, but at the moment it says 200. That one might take a little longer. The easiest way that I found is probably just going to be go into squads, fill it in with randoms, or if you have friends, go into squads, knock someone down and just pickaxe them. You get 90, 90 to 100 damage on them that easily. And literally, it'll take like two to three people who are knocked down and just you pickaxing them to complete that challenge. Probably the easiest way to do it, in my opinion. If not, if you're a solo player, then you can go into solo and complete it that way, the way I told you. Unfortunately, there is no knocking down in solo, so that'll just depend do you prefer to hit them while they're trying to scavenge or would you prefer to go into squads knock them down and then pickaxe them to get some extra damage that way i would say squads is probably the fastest and easiest way to do it all right so the next one pistol eliminations now this one the easiest way i would say either go into solo and you can literally kill someone really quick if you land with someone and you're the first one to grab the weapon that one you can go about it that way personally what i would say go once again into squads knock someone down you have to make sure that it's you who actually knocks them down and you want to just pull out your pistol and eliminate them so that's again another one you got to do it three times not too bad honestly go into squads knock them down and literally just kill them with a pistol it can be a silenced pistol it can be a deagle it can be just a regular pistol or like the weird shooty make make shoot one the one that i absolutely hate uh, it can be any one of those but just make sure you knock them down and then you hit them with the pistol and boom the elimination counts as yours it's not a kill it's just an elimination which is pretty pretty awesome and i'll finally the last one i'm going to be covering in this video is going to be eliminate opponents in tilted tower this one literally self-explanatory go into tilted tower kill three people boom you're done now that one i would say is probably going to be super crazy because tilted just in general is super active a ton of people go there and now we have a challenge that actually tells you to get kills in tilted so you're probably going to have a million people there it's probably going to be good for you though because if you have that many people that means there's going to be a lot of people running around with no weapons so go in there grab a basic weapon kill someone that's it do it three times not that hard do it solo i would not recommend squads it's going to be insane the amount of people going to tilt so just do it that way believe me it's going to be the best option for you all right so the last one that i was saving just because it's going to take the longest one to explain is going to be searching chest and moisty mire now the good thing normally these chests like searching stuff is super annoying just like in wailing woods that was literally the worst one and then we had to follow that one up with a bunch of other locations that were just as terrible so i would say the easiest thing to do since it is so big is just to go to any one of these chests honestly there's no secret to it i have an image with all the chest locations and i'm also going to have a ton of gameplay with a bunch of different chest locations that i found honestly probably a lot easier to complete this one than to complete the one that we had in wailing woods or in flush factory so i would say it shouldn't be too terrible find the location that's off to the sides and you'll probably find a few chests this one might take you a little bit longer so anyways that is all of the challenges apart from obviously the treasure map and then the gas station locations i'm going to have a separate video on that one 
But uh, hopefully this video was informative and helpful to you guys. Hopefully you guys complete these challenges super quick. And again, I'm making this video before the challenges are even out. So I'm giving you guys a head start on what these challenges are going to be. And then honestly, one of the best ways to get these done super, super fast. So thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hopefully it was informative. Hopefully it was helpful. If it was, if you want to support the channel, make sure you guys do slap a like and a favor on the video. It really does about. It is very much appreciated. And if you are new to the channel, if you want to see even more videos like these, if you enjoy the videos, first time around here make sure you guys do subscribe and turn on notifications by slapping that bell icon so you don't miss a single video here on the channel and try to cover as much fortnite content as i can so if you enjoy the videos make sure you guys do subscribe if you want to support the channel directly you can do so by joining my sponsor squad you get access to early videos exclusive content and a special badge that shows up on all of my live streams and in the comment sections of all of my videos. Check that out only if you are willing and able to. I also do have a Twitter. I'm giving away some Fortnite mobile codes over there, so make sure you guys follow me over there. And also, if you guys want to, I also do have a gaming and second channel. Check that out if you want more content. If you don't, totally cool. I'll see you guys next time. I'm out. Peace.